Right now, the Coast Guard is working to recover a boat that capsized near the James River Bridge in Newport News. Officials say five people were in that boat. So Nico Clemens is at Huntington Beach right now. So Nico, what exactly happened there? Yeah, Lucy, fortunately, this did not end worse than what it was. Those five people expected to be okay. Let's show you where, I, where I'm at and tell you how this rescue started. I'm here at Huntington Beach. That's the James River you see here in the James River Bridge. We're told that two members with the Newport News Fire Department's incident response team, they were out on the water getting ready for a training. It was two of them, and then they came across a boat that was quickly filling up with water. Moments later, that boat capsized, turned over. All five of those people, not sure if it was a family or what type of, uh, what was going on out there, but all five of them fell in the water. Officials say one of them had no pulse and wasn't breathing for a while. That's when they started CPR, and on the way back to the shore, that individual started breathing on their own before making it back here to the beach. Right now, that boat is still in the water somewhere out there on the other side of the James River Bridge. The Coast Guard and VMRS are both working to get that boat out of the water. Again, those five people are expected to be okay. We don't know the conditions of all five right now, but we know they were all taken to the hospital. We're not sure if they were wearing life vests or life jackets. We were out here earlier today. There were several people on the beach. We spoke with a few of them. You'll hear from some of them this afternoon on 13 News Now. But right now, I'm live in Newport News. Nico Clemens, 13 News Now.